So, hey guys, it's Abby from Super Spectacular Sisters, and I just feel like I needed to do this because I was going on GarageBand, and this is on a Mac laptop, and I have a different version of GarageBand than a lot of other people. Some have, might have the same as me, but I know some don't. So, I was looking up how to slow down a track on YouTube because I found a lot of tutorial videos on there but none of them were for the kind of garage band I had so I basically had to do it all myself and now that I've done it I feel like I should teach you guys so what you're gonna do is just get the um, one you want to add for example I want to do this one so you add that track over here this could take a little bit of time okay so it didn't this time and then you see this area right here so it'll like show you like all of this stuff like measures time uh this thing which is project and i'll let you mess with it and then chord which in this case there's no chord so we're gonna go back to this project and this lets you change the key that it's in it lets you change the signature but what we're gonna focus on is this allows you to change the tempo so if you just take this thing and scroll up and down you get to change the tempo, so what if I want it to be 198, and then I go back and I listen to it. I actually do like the way that sounds, but for this, I would like it to be way slower, and I'm going to turn it down to 70, which is where I want it to be. There. And then we listen to it. It's a bit too slow, so you just, if, if that's how you need if that's not how you need to be you just fix it wherever you need to go I'll try 95 I like that so that I'm going to stick with that as I add more to that song so that was really quick thank you guys so much for watching and be sure to check out more tutorials if they ever come up